Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, first I want to say thank you for having so much patience with me. As you can clearly tell, I have come down with some sort of cold or something. Um, so I wasn't able to do a video before today, and even today is a little iffy, but I did get my Ipsy, and I got something from Sephora, which I'm going to show you. I also wanted to show you that I finally got the Black Lip Flame the black flame candle from ColourPop. So I just wanted to quickly show you guys what it, like, I'm kind of disappointed. Um, for the amount of money that it costs, it just, it's like, I don't know. There it is there. It smells delicious. I will probably light that at some point. I do love the packaging. So there it is there. And then, I haven't lit it yet. It's been sitting here for a while. This is how sick I've been. So, um, I just redid all of my, like, around here and stuff. So, um, they actually sent me this lippy stick in a lane. So, I don't know if I'll use that or not, but I'm going to put that here. And then I actually got a top bot mission for Shea Moisture African Black Soap. So, I kind of posted on social media like haha I got soap you guys all got you know really nice shampoo and conditioner and I got soap and then people were kind of rude what I'm gonna say is is that I'm grateful to get anything for free I mean I just got pasta and I was excited about that um, just because you think that somebody isn't grateful doesn't mean that you need to say anything um, I've heard a lot of people complaining about sample sizes, and yeah, but anyway, I'm excited to try this after a few people said that it's really good soap. I didn't know, because I don't use soap, so I wouldn't know, right? So, okay, so I'm going to go in my Sephora here. Okay, so let's see this big box and it's just this so I've been waiting for this foundation to come on sale and it finally did and I had ten dollars off in points and there hasn't been anything in the points section so I thought I would grab this now it makes it's ivory I wonder if that's the color I meant to grab I wonder It looks a little light, but we're going to try it and see. Um, I haven't even put on my... I haven't even put on my... I can't even say it. My... Shoot. Okay, so anyway... Um... My camera just came on to say I only have 30 minutes, so I should make this pretty quick. Okay, so I gotta go grab something to wash that off. Okay, so I did grab the Danessa Merrick's Beauty Vision Flush, and I believe I actually grabbed something else. So I'm really disappointed. I, I grabbed both of the Danessa Merrick's, and then they just sent me the Shia Yerma UB Blonde. So I'm anti brass purple balm, bleach highlight blondes, peony and cool pigments. I actually don't have blonde hair, so I'm just going to put that in the thing down there. And then I got the Tatcha Liquid Silk Canvas, so I will give that a try. That'll be my concealer. Um, so I'm going to try out all of this makeup. And let's pull out my, oh, my Ipsy. So Ipsy is, I think, $14.95. It's $2.95 to ship to Canada. I can't remember. It's about $20 Canadian. It's absolutely um, a great box to get when you were just starting out. I am not going to talk a whole lot during this because my throat is starting to hurt. Okay, so I'm going to go through my add-ons first, and I do see all of my add-ons, so I am thrilled. Oh! I say that now. Look what I just did, guys. Oh. So I got the hip dot. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to use that today. 
Definitely not going to be giving it away now. Oh, and then I got Ar Argon. Argon. Removing wipes. These were $3. They're t super tiny, but I like them, especially when I'm down here, for things like this. Okay. So I want to say that the Jouer foundation is another foundation that is supposed to be high coverage. And I got it because um, I wanted to see if, if it would be comparable to other brands that I have in my selection. Okay, so those were both $3 add-ons. And I'm so mad for doing that. I am thrilled that I got this. I was really worried because they delivered this to my post office box. And I was like, oh my gosh, if they did not include this, I'm done with Ipsy. But they did, and it is here. And look at those colors. So I'm going to use this palette today. I am thrilled. Look at that pink and that yellow. Oh, okay. I already know what kind of look I'm doing. I am thrilled. I love Nomad Cosmetics. I'll also do swatches of all the colors, and I'll post a photo of that. Okay, so I'm actually just going to pull out my bag. So this is the bag this month. <laughs> okay. So the Nomad Cosmetics was $12, and that is a steal. So there's new Ipsy cards. Okay, so it looks like I got everything here. Okay, so I'm going to start with my super tiny pick. This is the Amia More Pacific Revolution. This is the full size of this product is 30 mil and it's worth $250. And this is three mils. So this is supposed to be worth $25 right here. Ouch. The next item I got um, is the exfoliant treatment for, is infused. Okay, so this is a Cosette salt facial scrub. So the full size is $24, and this is the deluxe set. So this is about $8. Okay, so this is the body butter. It's your new nightstand necessity. So this is tart sugar rush. Okay. So the full size is 300 grams and that's $28. And this is 20 grams. So it's probably about 4 or $5, I would say. I'll try to pop up the actual code. Mount right here. Okay. Um, and then this is the Unicorn Glow Longwear. Primer. I'm actually not going to use this. I'm probably going to put it in a giveaway. Um, I have tried the brand before. It's it's a great brand. It's just not my brand. Okay. So then I also got the YC Collection Light in the Dark Vintage. This is super cute packaging. I love that it's pressed. It's got a little thing. I love that. This is something you can take with you. So this is the full size sample. It's valued at $16 and 11 grams. This is three grams. So this is probably like two or three dollars. So it isn't bad now. This actually makes up the whole price of it. It is so tiny. <sighs> okay guys, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna step off the camera and I'm going to um, use the foundation. And the the Tatcha, and I'll hey be guys. right back. I tried. It is so light. So this color isn't for me, but I do like <clears throat> the coverage. So I'm going to see if I can get down to the city this week and exchange it. Um, if not, I guess I'll figure out something else with it. But it is gorgeous. It, it does work. Um, okay, so... I want to go in. I'm so like flustered right now. So I went to use this and then I realized I actually have it already. So I just used my other one. So maybe I'll put that one in a giveaway. Who knows? Okay, so I kind of want to make this quick. I'm going to go in with Baby Grand. rearranged everything so now I gotta remember that all right so I'm actually gonna go in with this London color so I'm gonna actually take this bar 3674 right here So 
So I was reading the reviews on this, and it's so funny. Everyone's like, they either like it or they really like it. But some of the complaints were just funny, like, too bright of colors. Well, you see the palette before you bought it, so what, what's the sense of buying it if you didn't like the bright colors, right? But, but everyone said that it's highly pigmented, and it is very much pigmented. So I'm actually going to take this yellow color here. It's called Istanbul. She mentioned that. Okay, so I am going to go in with this Roaring Twenties as an underliner here. I'm going to take this nightcap and just I'm going to go in with my mascara and I'll be right back. So I'm going to go in actually with this highlighter. <clears throat> Ooh. Kind of see that I uh I love this foundation. I just need it in my color. That is all. Okay, so I feel like the reddish color that I got here is just too bright for this look. Okay, I've never tried these. These are nice. Why is it now that when I put on lipstick, stick, stick, stuff, lipstick, I wanted to sparkle. <coughs> okay, guys. So I'm going to actually put this in um, my makeup giveaway. I have some other things here that I think I'm going to do a giveaway with. Um, I know I pulled it out. I think it's, it's over here. Yes. So I'm going to put in the Pure Foundation. It may not work for you, but you can always gift it to a friend. It's been open but not used, I think. Um, the Anastasia Bra... Um, eye Primer. I am going to put in the Unicorn Glow Longwear Primer as well. Is I think that's it for right now, but I can't remember if that was it. Yes, that was it. So that will be coming up next week or later this week. I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so the items that I did get in my Ipsy box were great, but it was really heavy on skincare. But that's probably because I did choose a skincare product. Why do I feel like I'm missing something here? There's three. Oh my gosh, did, what else did I get? So scatterbrained, guys. So scatterbrained. Oh, the unicorn. That's right, because I just put it in here. <laughs> All right. So, definitely a like. I'm actually excited to try this, and I do want to try this. I do have a skincare giveaway. I am going to add this Tatcha Primer because I have so many primers so I don't need it um, I'm gonna add that to actually no I'm gonna add this to the this the makeup gets giveaway so yes um, so it's about a three out of ten I don't mind the highlighter it is super pretty it is super blendable really nice actually I would probably put this
that works for me. So yeah, um, I'll definitely be putting that my little my little pal. Um, <clears throat> the Jouer foundation. I'm going to have to see if I can get a different color. Though now that it's oxidized, it actually isn't bad. I don't think so. This might be more of my winter um, foundation. So maybe I'll have to wait and see. Um, I'll have to see what the pictures look like because obviously, yeah, but it does cover really well and I'm really thrilled with that. Um, so yeah, I might have to, I might have to see, I might even just get a darker and then mix the two, especially if it's still on sale for like $35. Um, <clears throat> Nomad, what can I say? I absolutely love you. Please put me on your PR list. Thank you. Um, I would never be disappointed in Nomad. Um, Nomad has stolen my heart. This is the second palette I have from them. And I absolutely adore their formulas, their, um, their, so, um, their products are really great. So they do not have Talic in them. This is, uh, designed on location, traveling the Venice Simple on Express manufactured at Nomad Labs in China. So, but... This is simply amazing. I love, I love the uh, the colors in this. Um, I definitely want to get my hands into this blue in this color here. So maybe that'll be a look for another day. This was definitely worth the add-ons and the subscription price to Ipsy. I'm gonna give these a try out as well as the ammo, the um, items I got. I will likely kind of bump them into my skincare. As for this, now this was really hard to open. But it is super cute. I think these three colors are going to work well together um, and make a really nice night eye. So I will be doing a video later on this week with this, perhaps when I am feeling a lot better. I also want to say this is super exciting. I do wish that Sephora had added what I wanted out of it because they had the concealer and I wanted to try it today. I'm also going to say that I am getting the Jouer uh, concealer, so I'm going to do a whole look and then uh, go from there on it. Um, I am really, really excited to try this bread and butter right here. So I'm going to do another video just on this placard. Um, and I'm also going to say thanks to Colourpop for sending me this. This has got to be one of my new favorite lip colors. And I think that is it. So if you do sign up for Ipsy, you can go ahead and sign up down below using my link. I do get uh, some extra points. The bag is actually really cute. It's like... Um, is it's like it's an astroturf. I swear my grandfather had this kind of carpet in his house when I was a kid. So yeah. Um, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much for having some patience with me. I hope you guys have a great day, and please don't forget to give this video a like, give it a share, and make sure you're subscribed.